No! I know, I know, I had to stop the video, I'm back. It was 11 minutes, I'm like, oh god, I gotta stop the video. Not a good idea to try to stop videos while you're trying to uh, play a game like Block. Yeah. Definitely no! Come on! Hit it! Fucking bastard. Alright, that's one. That's another one. Come on. Sorry for screaming. Come on. Come on, man. Yes! Okay. Sorry for screaming. No, I just wanted to see if V had the cat. <laughs> had the little dumbass. Was that what you were looking for? Yeah, I wanted to see how she was doing, too. Yeah, she was doing fine. She was talking with Dad about, uh, the bills. And pay. You know, stuff that we wouldn't understand because we're stupid. We're not stupid, we just... We just don't understand it? Yeah. Alright! And it would be a pain in the Boss ass. Boss time! Is that the Grim Reaper? <laughs> oh. It's like we're missing our shots. Are you serious? You are a bastard. Alright, that's one. Oh Alright, that's another. We gotta kill the Grim Reaper. Why do you look like us? Hey! What is he, a future version of us? We did He's dead. Ah! We got him. <laughs> Holy shit. What time is it? Oh. Oh, hey, do you guys want to go to the netherworld? No. I don't. Pay for the house. Did like, you pay for that ha mansion? Oh, what a dickhead! Well, th thank God, it was only one gold. I can't, I'm a fucking wizard. I'm a fucking wizard. Joe, we're in the netherworld. So you know the Japanese voice actors for uh, Frenorin? For uh, Feyren? Yeah, she's Anya. Oh, fuck, of course. That explains the face. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking face. They keep making her play smug characters. Because it's good. It's good. <laughs> that face Feyren makes. So... Is it safe to say that Capcom doing crossovers means they uh, have their sights on a new crossover game they might be planning and may, yeah. and may or may not be telling Dude, us? Dude, 10 days until Echo. If you guys don't know, Echo is essentially about this uh, 
She's a girl, I believe, that's like missing a leg and she can't speak. Is it an anime series? No, it's a Marvel series. Oh, shit. Oh, Echo. I think she was in... She might be joining the Thunderbirds. I don't know, though, for sure. She might be joining the Avengers at some point. The new Avengers. So she's just a handicapped Yeah, but Zach, guess who's in it, and you won't believe it. Who's in Echo series? Kingpin. Oh, Joe Yoshi's... <laughs> Kingpin's like, you're just like me. You're just like me for real. You just want to see. You just dude, want, dude, you just want to saw, see the whole he world. Saw, he saw the. He saw. He like, saw this girl's dad, and he's like, and he, he saw this girl getting bullied by this hot dog dude. Goes, grabs the hot dog dude, and starts beating him in the fucking alley. What, Kingpin? Yeah. King, dude, King, this is in the trailer. I gotta show you the trailer. No, no I saw it. Kingpin's just built different. <laughs> and he's dude, like, don't be afraid. You know, Kingpin. Kingpin is the one villain that fucked around and found out. Cause you know what he did. He did the one thing super... Oh, in the comics? Oh he my did the God. one thing super villains never did. He almost killed Aunt May. Yeah, and <laughs> Spider-Man... He, and guess he what Spider fucked around and found and out. Spider-Man beat Kingpin half to death. And, and almost, made the no. other prisoners watch. And the prison guards watch. Because he's like, if you ever mess with Aunt May again, and if you tell anyone my identity... Watch Kingpin. You know what happens. And I'm no, like, bro, bro, you know what actually happened? He kills someone and then he beats Kingpin half to death. And you know what he says? No, he almost... Uh, no, he stops. He almost... He, he beats him half to death and then he stops and he says, You better... I'm coming back if... if he's like, if Aunt May di it dies, uh, dies... That's all I'm coming back for your life. Hey, Joe, you know the money that um he fucking used to use Aunt May? That was Kingpin's money. Yeah, no, no, bro, no, but bro, bro, you know what he says? If Aunt May they dies, if Aunt I May will finish what I started. started. Oh my Holy God. shit. It's like, that's not the only thing. He grabs the black suit. He's wearing the black suit. Oh, no, nah, he put, he put the black ones on. <laughs> oh, shit. He's, he's not <laughs> fucking around anymore. And he, t and here's the funny thing. He took off the mask to beat the shit out of Kingpin. Because, no, it was personal. It was no He's longer like, just Spider-Man. This is Spider-Man Spider business. This, this is fucking This is Peter Parker business. being your fucking ass. <laughs> Kingpin is probably one of the best. And he actually made Kingpin piss himself. <laughs> he made this man wet himself. He was terrified. That's why no one fucks with Spider-Man. I think a lot of people don't, like, understand how strong Spider-Man actually Spider -Man is. Spider-Man is just as strong as the fucking Hulk. You don't want to fuck with him, all right? Not just as strong. No, he's he's stronger than Captain America in some of the comics. He fucking stopped guys, his shield! Guys, there's one oh. point where he broke Cap's shield. Yeah, that was the same, same comic, too. He broke he Cap's shield he in front of him. He dented Cap's he's like, shield. He's like, I'm sorry. May so I mind you, that's fucking, uh, what is it called? Animantium? The strongest metal in the Marvel Universe. And in pure rage, Peter fucking Parker... Peter Bash Parker broke that shit. shit out of pure rage. This is why... That, you know what that could mean? He could probably bend Wolverine's Peter, claws. Peter Parker... If he wanted to. Peter Parker is what we describe as that one guy like that's so sweet and so nice, but the moment you fuck you know, with them, you, know, you chose death. No, you know the meme where it's like, uh, what's scarier? Oh, fuck. I gotta look it up. It's, uh... It's essentially, it goes like... Do not mess with a... I don't fear a angry man. I fear a gentleman when enraged. Yeah. I mean... Look. Essentially along those lines. And because they hold that shit in. <laughs> they hold their <laughs> anger in. Like, you don't want to fuck with that. And you kind of remind me a bit of that, bro. That whole sentiment. Because throughout your high school year, you didn't do shit to nobody, and then all of a sudden, this kid went to fuck with you, and you went fucking ham on this kid. I'm like, you better hold me back, because I swear to God, I will kill well, this you did, child. You did have restraint, thank God. The, That's the why I told to I told the others to stop me, because if I don't, this kid is getting his life beaten out of him. And the worst part was, that kid was high. So, he, he, felt he wouldn't it. even be conscious if I actually did full through with what I did. He wouldn't even be conscious. 
And that's the scarier part, too. He would have no clue he died over something so fucking stupid that he did. He died for being high. Well, at least that kid reformed himself. At least he's better now. Yeah. Last time I saw him, he, he had a good girl. He was treating her well. He stopped vaping. And then everyone else just went to shit. Every other kid just went to fucking I like, hell. I like how he... I kept those guys from snapping. And the moment I left, everything went to hell. And one of the kids told Zach, he like, he got his, he had his number. I fucking, I honestly called it. I sadly called it. I'm like, I'm like, I knew I fucking kept you guys. He's like, yeah, we were scared because we didn't want to fuck with you out of fear. <laughs> So if I told one of the kids to do something, they fucking did it. <laughs> no questions asked. <laughs> they did not want to fuck with me. Now, Mine wasn't so much fear. I don't think people feared me at my school. It was more... Oh, they, they treated me like a big brother. I, I would... I wouldn't say they I went out of like my way to, either. like, help them out. I was a pretty chill dude. If you... And... The, the people see me when I'm mad. I've never gone physical. Uh, but they've seen me when I'm mad. It's probably why a lot of girls were, like, really hesitant to go out with me. I, I this, don't blame there's them. There's this one girl that, like, we were we were in class together, and she was a middle schooler. I was a high schooler. I'm more we were of a all, friend We were all in the up, same upstairs. Right. And this this kid in my class decided, oh, let's make a KKK joke. Oh. And I fucking lost my shit. Oh. And, and, and the fucking, um, what is it, the... Well, we'll talk about that in the next